combining things like a rocket-powered gas canister, uh, a magic bungee cord, mag grenade, and a harpoon gun stuck to a box with a person stabbed through. It's very difficult to describe, but that's the kind of play scenario that people are going to start messing around with. Episode 3, Inside the Toy Box. As you progress through the game, you get access to more powerful weapons, and some of those weapons are just out of this league compared to the, the weapons you've had before. For some reason, a lot of uh, explosive things just lying around Pacific City as well, so there's always a, a new prop to grab or a new explodable of some type. UV shotgun at a molecular level kind of breaks the freaks down and they basically just melt in its absolute awesomeness. But I just use that word. When you get your rocket launcher for the first time, you think, oh, I'm going to go back there, and then totally f*** them up. <laughs> Mags as well that have been added. The basic premise is that you stick one to any object you like, whether it's environment or a, or a prop, and then stick the next one to anything you like as well. The kind of lighter of the two will be pulled towards the heavier. So you can mag grenade two things to the walls, and then you can mag grenade the vehicle, pull it back, slingshot. You can attach it to the base of the helicopter and attach anything you like to the base and then you can carry that wherever you like. You can do anything you want really. We were bringing in a few new orb types like renegade orbs that actually run away from the player and make it very hard for them to be caught. You've got to find it, get up on the rooftop and then chase it down. So there's ones that are on the road that you've got to get in a car and chase after in the car and collide with. Sometimes you've actually got to glide after them so they'll literally fly across from one island to another. I think people will recognise some of the vehicles on the whole from, from Crackdown, but we've modified them considerably. The buggy, which has got a twin machine gun on the roof, that's incredibly agile, that can flip and roll. And The agency supercar, which is insanely quick, it's the fastest car in the entire game. And then you go up to the agency tank, which is the hardest vehicle in the entire game. You can just drive over cars at high speed, and that's not really what tanks do. <laughs> it's a super tank, if you like. <laughs> you can jump in a chopper and just hose everyone down from the air. You can arm your helicopter with uh, rocket launchers and, and chain guns, and it's complete mayhem. I mean, you're flying around the city and you're just letting off these endless supply of rockets sort of thing, and everything's blowing up on the streets. You can string so much together that uh, you're never going to run out of fun. We've got this whole new toy set and people are just going to have fun in whole new ways just with the, the extra stuff we've added, with the, the, the new props, the new weapons, the new vehicles. I mean, just it's going to open up a whole new avenue for people to explore and have fun and just create their own game within a game.